Hey guys, so today we're going to be trying some new highlights from Wet n Wild. From time to time they bring out their limited edition highlight collections and I have three in front of me. So if you guys are curious to see what they are, how they swatch and how they apply, then just keep watching. Okay, so they first came out with a, an entire display of their like bar highlights. I know that they previously come out with their gold bar, which I have from before. And then they came out with this one and two like goldy bronze shades. And I believe like a rose gold shade. This one is the called Winter Bloom. It was the lightest one on the display. And it says on here that they come with a mirror. So on the side, if you have nails, you can pull out a little mirror to apply your highlight with, with, which I think is really fun for on the go. I mean, and these are very affordable. They're like two or three dollars, I wanna say, for a highlight bar and a mirror. So I think that's a great little packaging bonus. So let me show you the inside of the packaging. This is what it looks like. They all have the star of one color and then the bar in another color to look like a gold bar. So let me show you the two colors. So the star is a bit more of like a bronzy shade and then the rest of a bar is like a beautiful white gold. Can you guys see them? So the bar and the star, that rhymes, ha <laughs> ha. So this one is a really nice option for a paler skin. I personally think I'm gonna love this one. It's not too yellow, not too gold, not too white, but this one might actually work when I have a bit of a tan too. So I feel like this was a good option for me. The other ones would have been great for darker skin tones. But I didn't pick all those up. I just kind of wanted to give you a sample of what was on that display. So this one I found at Walgreens. This one is from the Fire and Ice display, which I found at Ulta. I could not find this one at Walmart, at Walgreens, at CVS. The only place I found it was at Ulta. And this is the Winter Falls in LA. This one does not have a mirror, but it has like this beautiful icy snowflake pattern on the front. And the color is like a beautiful minty green-ish blue shade right here, which I personally love the minty green highlights. Um, if this is too blue for me, it may not work, but if it's green, I think I'm gonna love it. I get so many compliments when I wear like the tealy minty highlights, which don't look natural, but I guess on my skin tone they do because I have a lot of greenish in my veins, I don't know. But this one is also a good option for lighter skin. They had a blue one and then an icy white one. I just picked up the green because I know what I like. The third one, which I also found at Walgreens, is their Rainbow Highlighter. And this is also limited edition and it is in Everlasting Glow and it looks like this. And this one doesn't have a pattern per se. It's just like a striped highlight of different shades. Now I don't know if I can swatch all of these, um, but I will try to do a couple of pinks, a white, this goldy shade, and maybe this like bluish looking one. So here are four of the shades in this pan and I'll do them right here for you. So it looks like we have a gold, a blue, a pink, and almost a greenish one. So you kind of get a little bit of everything. And this is by far the driest formula of all three of these. I really had to dig in the pan to get the color. So let me just swirl them and see what color I get. Looks like kind of like an icy highlight. So this is definitely a good option for fairer skinned gals and boys out there. So I think I'm going to start off with, I'm gonna start off with my green one because I personally think I'm gonna love this one. So we'll start with this one on the one side and see what we can get. You guys see that? It's like a nice minty highlight, but not too, it doesn't make me look like an alien or like a lizard. It just kind of, I don't know, it just looks really nice. Okay, so that's that side. Next, let's try the platinum bar and I think I'm just going to go with the light color first. Ooh, That's really nice. It's not too yellow and it's not too white. I feel like it's actually just blending into my skin color. I mean you can still see the glow 
but it blends in more easily. So that's nice. Um, you could definitely do this one here and on the nose. It's very subtle. It's more yellow than I expected. I thought it would be like a very, very light color, but it's more of like a yellowy highlight, which I'm a little disappointed by. I thought it would have more of like the white undertones. All right, since I'm not super impressed with this one, let's try this pinky rainbow one, and I'm just gonna kind of swirl my brush through the pinks, the yellows, the blues. Yeah, that one's a lot lighter. You can see it now right here. That's the light shade from this palette. So if you have fair skin, I feel like this is gonna be a really good option for you because it does show up very light on the skin. Now, none of them are super, super reflective. Perhaps that would change if I sprayed my face. So give me a second. Let me do a little MAC Fix Plus on the face and then we will try the green again and then the multicolor one. All right, back in with the rainbow one. Okay, it's definitely like giving me whitish vibes, not really pink and gold. And then on this side, while my face is still a bit damp, let's try the snowflake one. Okay, so I think I like this one when my skin's a little paler. I do like the greenish effect. And this one also would be nice when my skin is paler. Now let's clean off the brush and try the gold one on the nose again. Okay, so that's a good nose highlight. It's a nice goldish shade, but not overpowering. I would say that if you have, I would say if you have a lighter skin tone than me, this one may not work because it's actually showing up more yellow than I expected, as I mentioned before. But anyway, here are the try-ons. Here is the Fire and Ice highlight in Winter Falls, LA. Over here is the rainbow highlight. This one is Evergl Everlasting Glow. And on the nose is the platinum bar in the shade Winter Bloom. So I hope you guys found this kind of try on and swatch video helpful to kind of know what's out there as far as the limited edition highlights go from Wet n Wild. So let me know if you found this video helpful. Give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.